Remember when gulping down on a soda bottle with fried deli meats off the street or an extra toppings pizza was our way of making dinner? Those carefree college years had us feasting on youthful indulgences without a second thought. But the menu upgrades as the pages turn, and the years add depth to our story. Diet becomes more than just a plate of sustenance, it's the script of aging gracefully. Sure, the occasional treat might find its way into your plate, and why not? Life's too short for a bland diet. But as the curtains rise on the golden chapter of our lives, certain foods become a health hazard, a silent mortal enemy hiding in plain sight. These aren't just your average forbidden fruits, they're the troublemakers at the feast of life after 50. So let's uncover the culinary villains, not to cramp your style, but to script a healthier and longer encore for the second act of your life. Sodium. Cutting back on salt can be a game changer for health, especially after 50. A low sodium diet can assist in managing conditions like high blood pressure and kidney and liver diseases. It's not about banishing taste, it's a savvy choice for a vibrant life. Sodium in excess can lead to increased blood pressure, paving the way for serious health issues. Curbing sodium can help manage conditions like high blood pressure, kidney problems, and even liver diseases. Eating fresh foods like veggies, fruits, and low sodium can or frozen options can be a smart start. Swap the salt for flavorful herbs, spices, or citrus zest. Be cautious of sneaky sources of sodium in prepared or packaged foods like sauces, processed meats, and convenience snacks. Sugary treats. It must be one of the hardest items to avoid considering the love for soda drinks, desserts, and the sweet delicacies that run rampant worldwide. This sweet tooth pandemic might be like a craving to some, but it is a red flag for all those slowly turning older. Sugar is one of the most lethal items. And if you don't want a chubby waistline or a huge prescription to fill out at the drugstore every month, you must say adios to sugar forever. As you might have heard, diabetes is caused by increased sugar intake, but that is just the start of the tale. Diabetes is a predisposing factor to almost all lethal diseases. High blood pressure, heart diseases, infections, and kidney failures are all just a few comorbid bad omens brought along with diabetes. And the sole perp is sugar. If you want a sweet delight, try replacing sugar with fructose or natural honey. Artificial sweeteners seem like a suitable alternative, but they still have some nasty side effects. Alcohol. Knowing that our bodies process liquor differently at different ages might be interesting. As we age, changes in our bodies affect how alcohol impacts us. Muscles diminish, fat increases, and the system has less water. This means alcohol isn't diluted as much as it once was, leading to higher blood alcohol levels. Our body produces less of an alcohol digesting enzyme, making the effects of alcohol last longer. This enzyme reduction is more pronounced in women. After 50, our ability to gauge the effects of alcohol weakens. We might not realize the impact on our reflexes or balance. Hangovers might get more severe due to dehydration, which becomes more common as we age. Oddly enough, our sense of thirst diminishes and alcohol further dehydrates us. Age-related changes like diminished eyesight, hearing, and slower reflexes can make even small amounts of alcohol make us feel intoxicated. This increases the risk of falls and accidents and worsens medical conditions like high blood pressure or ulcers. Additionally, older individuals often take more medications and mixing these with alcohol can be dangerous, even deadly. It's essential to be mindful of how alcohol interacts with drugs in later years. Coffee. Coffee is the ultimate wake-up call for many of us, with older adults leading the way in coffee consumption. Three quarters of Americans aged 55 and above enjoy about three cups a day. While coffee perks us up and has some health benefits, keeping an eye on caffeine is crucial. Caffeine, found in various plants, is known for its energizing effects. It kicks in fast, making us alert, but in older adults, excess caffeine can lead to dehydration and unwelcome side effects like insomnia, jitters, headaches, and stomach issues. Around 400 milligrams of caffeine daily, roughly four cups of coffee, is all right for most seniors. Yet, caffeine lurks in many products beyond coffee, from tea to soda and even decaf. Please pay attention to what you drink throughout the day as everything adds up. And remember, some medications contain caffeine too. Monitor your caffeine intake to avoid unwelcome side effects and stay healthy. 
fried foods. Fried food is undoubtedly very delicious. The aroma, taste, the salty, crunchy feeling. It's a fine blend of savory childhood nostalgia, deep fried and some hearty flavors. However, it might not be as delicious, compromising some good ripe adulthood years for a few munches of your local fried chicken. Let me take you through what fried foods can do to your body. Deep frying a dish results in more than twice as many calories. Cooking oils cooked to high degrees include higher trans fats lipids linked to several health issues. Fried food might raise your risk of diabetes and heart disease. Does it imply you will always be unable to enjoy delectable fried foods? Nope. However, you may make some excellent substitutions to minimize the harm to your health. The good news is that there are many ways to cook almost anything fried. Furthermore, it significantly affects how healthful your food is. Try experimenting with other types of oil if fried foods are missing from your list of things to avoid. Coconut, avocado, and olive oils can add health benefits to your favorite recipes. Still, consider air frying or baking your meal to achieve comparable results without adding needless and dangerous fats. It won't be the end if you occasionally eat french fries, but consciousness alters everything, as it always does. Also, it will assist you in selecting the healthier option so your diet is balanced. Processed food Have you ever wondered if grabbing a hot dog from the cart outside your office daily or making a pastrami sandwich for a light snack is a safe option now that you've aged a bit? Indeed, these items are staple for most households, but the hazards they withhold are shocking. And it gets worse if your body has already lived its young, carefree years and is in the danger zone of being susceptible to upcoming diseases. Let's give you guys an overview. The chances of developing colorectal cancer rises by 18%. Compared to persons who consume it once a month or fewer, you have a 19% greater risk of diabetes and a 42% higher risk of coronary heart disease. Despite these alarming figures, it would be best not to give up on indulging in your favorite charcuterie plates or delicious sandwiches. Instead, go for healthy substitutes like roasted or cooked meat, canned salmon, canned tuna. As with anything on our list, the goal is to increase the frequency of these substitutions gradually. Although it seems daunting to stick to all these dietary restrictions and cut down on all your favorite food, life is precious. It might seem giving up on all of this is talking the flavor out of life, but for more critical ambitions, dreams, and aspirations, losing all that matters over a few minutes of taste is too big of a gamble. Your health is your priority and life is too short to give it up to predator diseases, losing the quality of life entirely. So that's all for today, folks. If you like our video, remember to click like on our video and give us a thumbs up and do subscribe to our channel for more exciting stuff.